Is it work appropriate? It's definitely, uh, you know, towing the line. <laughs> but I think with the jacket. Uh, eyes up here, Arya. Yeah. No, 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 eyes no. up here. <laughs> I feel uncomfortable to wear lingerie just because I'm a little bit heavier chested and I'm a little bit more conservative with the way I dress. So my style kind of changes. On the weekends, I like to dress up. I'm really uncomfortable showing anything fitted, too much leg or too much boob at work. I don't think I've owned a piece of lingerie, so this will be just a completely new experience. At work, I'm not super confident and I really want to change that because I see people like Jazz and Chrissy and they just like rock everything they wear. I don't like to call attention to to what I wear and when you see lingerie, you're just asking for attention. What better way to feel cute at work than throwing myself into a video where I wear lingerie as clothes? Like that's so far out of my comfort zone. So it looks like I'm wearing um, barely nothing today. There is no hiding in this. This is definitely not work appropriate and it's very, very short. So I'm gonna cover up the girls a little bit. I'm gonna make a few alterations and I think I'll be good and work appropriate. It's very cute for the bedroom. I can see the safety pins. That could have been more subtle. <laughs> You know, I'm not a seamstress, so this is what I gotta work with. Okay, Chloe. I just realized why I don't wear hats to work. I can't put my headphones on. This so, is such a look. This is like a hot brunch look. All right. Mm -hmm. cool. Yeah, you look great. So I should wear more hats. This Please. Not, I feel very embarrassed wearing a hat. Why? Because it's not what I usually do. It doesn't matter. I'm sure that's not my comfort zone. No, yeah, it doesn't matter. Everyone wears hats. Well, at first I was like, wow, she looks witchy. <laughs> and then also I thought, wow, you're more covered up than you normally are. And then I came around to the front and I was like, oh no, it's the opposite. <laughs> I think I made a few people uncomfortable wearing this top. And now I'm gonna stop looking down there. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna. Uh... I was like so worried about that. That's why I wore this jacket because I was trying to like hide yeah. the goods. I am glad I added the coat as an addition to this outfit because I think wearing this alone to work would have been a distraction for many people. Next, I wore a bodysuit from Forever 21's lingerie line, and I can't believe this was considered lingerie because it just looked like a cute bodysuit. I'm walking into work and I'm a little nervous to see if anyone will notice if I'm wearing lingerie. Are you wearing lingerie? Yes, I, I am. I notice it. Mm -hmm. Where is it? It's here. Oh. It's a bikini, right? That's it's a, a bathing piece. suit. It's a right? bathing suit. It's a one piece bathing suit. I, you know, would expect maybe some more uh, feathers, <laughs> some furs, some boas. It yes. looks more like a bathing suit than it looks like lingerie. Mm. Right? So you right. mean to tell me that these both are lingerie? Yeah. Yes. I don't believe you because <laughs> these just look like tank tops. No one has thought it's lingerie, which is kind of the reason I got it because I just wanted to see if I could get away without anyone thinking it was lingerie. It's on your back. Maybe, well, I just maybe put a bra because I don't want to show my nips, okay? Yeah, no, I, I was having that exact fear. Being a heavier chested girl, like sometimes I do need that extra support from my bra because it would shape my body better. There's nothing wrong if you want to wear one. If you don't, it's about what makes you feel comfortable and confident. The next day was another bodysuit. It had a thong. See-through as f so I have to put on like a bra situation. It's, but it's a cute bra situation because it has like a really nice back. So I'm just gonna style it for an everyday look and pairing it with a shirt underneath really made the difference. I honestly like legitimately just think that it looks great. I don't think that it's like too much. I feel weird like I'm checking you out, but yeah, I think it looks great. Okay, great. I had plans on wearing that dress to go out. Who am I kidding? I just don't go out anymore. I'm like an old woman. Which, which I'm not 100% happy about, but I don't know how else to dress it. I'm going out for my friend's birthday. I've seen way like worse. This is like tame for me. But... I feel very confident in this. I probably couldn't wear it anywhere but like a bar or restaurant, but I do feel quite confident in it. As you should. Thanks, darling. On the fourth day, I wore a white bralette so the next day was the scariest day for me. 
It was Thistle and Spire's bodysuit and it was very lacy. I can't wear a bra with it, which I don't like, but it's quite covering, I guess, so that's okay. You are so hot. I, really? Because I'm feeling very insecure right You are so hot. Why are you insecure in any Your way? Your body is hot. Hot. banging. It was just very out of my comfort zone, especially because it was showing a lot of my boobs, which I don't have. So it was just emphasizing the fact that I didn't have any, but I think actually it was a nice shape and it kind of flattered me. A lot of people didn't think I was wearing lingerie yet again. I think I did such a great job disguising that this was lingerie. Now how's this lingerie? Where's the lingerie? Yeah, where's... It, it is, look. This. That just looks like, oh, this is just that, a just looks, that looks no. like a tank top. It's a tank top from Zara, don't lie to me. You can call it whatever you want, it's a sports bra. <laughs> one of the executives just kind of like walked by me and I was like, oh, and then one of the lawyers walked by and I'm just like, yeah, I look really overdressed. The men in the office had no idea what a bralette meant. It's a bra, but it's thicker. It's got, it's, you know, it's got the strap. I, I don't understand how this is a bralette. A bralette is like what? Younger girls, when they hit puberty, they, start, they wear bralettes because they're not ready for a bra, so they're ready for the bralette. Right? Oh, so they're no! Is this a, <laughs> no! a training bra? It's a training bra. <laughs> That's it's what a, he like, just said. Is a training bra not like what you wear when you go running? That's a sports bra. I had to shoot a video this afternoon, and I kind of was relieved to just be like stuck in a room on my own. Everyone that I ended up going near, I just felt like kind of insecure. The next day, I put a picture on Instagram and I got so many amazing comments about it. If I'd known that that's how people reacted on the outside world, I would have walked around with more confidence than I did that day. It is the last day of the challenge and this one is one of the scarier ones for me. Um, it's a bralette that goes just to like just under the boob, so so much of my stomach is gonna be exposed. One question about this. How does one wear this? According to the photo, it looks like this. I think for our purposes of trying to style this, I think I'm gonna convert it into kind of like a tube top situation. My sister was just like a little shocked that I was con I was considering going out wearing just a bra. She's a nude woman! <laughs> no, you're fine. Okay. Let's go shopping. Would you wear it? I don't like to have been breathing in all day. Hence, this is loose. It's a strategic way of wearing a crop top because it's super loose with like half an inch of skin revealed. I feel like my sister judged me a little bit, but to be honest, I would probably do the same thing to her and I think it's probably just something we both need to work on with each other. You were there in the beginning when I first received I this was. package. Yeah, it's a granny panty with suspenders. Do you this think I pulled good. it off? I think you totally pulled it off. I'm you definitely had to pull some magic out on that. <laughs> definitely. So hot. Ugh. Becky's like in nice kind of like breezy wear. I feel just very, uh, well, kind of covered in the arm region. This one was the most complicated to style, um, and I constantly have to pull this up because it just always goes down. A lady came up to me and said that she really liked my outfit, and that made me feel very nice. This week, I made the lingerie my version of sexy, and I think that whatever makes you feel comfortable and confident, that's sexy. Wearing lingerie to work has just made me want to take more fashion risks. I'm glad that I was able to take the lingerie and make it my own and dress it comfortably for myself. This week let me feel a little bit better about dressing up, so I just need to go for it. Hey, Unsolved is on a new channel, and now your part. Subscribe, Subscribe here. here. That was my part.